Who's your girl getting married? Hey. Hello, this is your girl Shantana Romina. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, you haven't got a chance to subscribe. Make sure you hit that red button and if you're returning, welcome, welcome back. So welcome to our first episode of my wedding diary so from me here that y'all know what is going to be expected of that whole series that whole episode it's everything about our wedding and i come to bring it across to you live from my camera live from all the actions behind the scene and everything of our wedding planning sorry for the chut noise for our wedding planning so the series are i should say the episode depending on who i'm going to retweet it later on it's going to be our wedding diaries okay so everything wedding is going to be in that diary and i also will create a playlist for you guys so you guys can actually watch as i go along okay so without no further ado let's jump into the video yes guys so there's so much to tell you guys um just in case you're new here you have no clue what's going on i actually got engaged june 6 2021 and no we're actually in may 2022 so your girl gonna get married you go you're looking at a whole wife now so like get used to the appearance so the real reason of actually doing a wedding diaries i always love wedding and stuff and just by me already having a platform already i decided i'm gonna take you along the journey with me just for those that you know getting married those who know somebody getting married yeah your partner planning on getting married i hope that this video can actually inspire someone it can actually help someone so it's not for me to come here and to like oh i'm showing off i'm getting married all these things like no it's here you are here to learn and the content is also to help you to, to prepare for the events that is coming up in your life and i'm so excited for this one as well so yes but before i get into the details where i'm at within my wedding planning a quite of you guys asked me like what would i want for my wedding um to be honest um i really don't know like i do have a registry it's not like a signed registry to say hey you can go by azon or you can go by a course or you can go by singer i do have a few stuff that i would actually need because you girl gonna move out and start life on our own so you know household appliance and all those stuff but i created that list for those person that are coming on the wedding to the wedding i should say i create that list for those person coming to the wedding so for like my social media families um also friends that i haven't heard from a while they actually reach out to me regarding the gifts that i want so for here for this platform i'll leave my paypal link down below so you guys can also send funds by paypal i would also leave my jamaican account for those who don't have um a paypal I, i'm going to leave my jane account information down below and also for those that are overseas and want to give you pretty girl <laughs> and your handsome boy that's again to get married i'll also leave a us account where you guys can send phone if you want you can always dm me or send me an email or text me on ig wherever you want to text me and we can exchange information where needed okay so thank you guys for those who reach out to offer a gift and thanks for those gifts that are yet to come as well yeah i will really appreciate those gifts <laughs> whether monetary gift prior well wish words of encouragement word of advice i will take them all okay so 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 far there's so much on my list um i do write a lot this is a little diary my mother-in-law gave me this diary so i basically like have everything detailed written out color scheme i can't show you some of the stuff then because i'm gonna expose myself here but i basically have everything written down in this book so it's always good to actually have a book or you can use the notes on your phone i use them interchangeable so what i have thus far regarding the wedding planning is that I selected the date of the wedding i can't share it with you guys i'm not ready to share that date with you you guys have to watch the series or watch the diary watch the wedding diaries okay so you guys will keep up to date i want to post y'all will be the first so make sure to turn on the post notification bell so i've selected the date of our wedding the date that we initially wanted 
um we didn't get that date but i mean it was a little bit upset in a sense but it went i think it actually happened for the better the date that i won wasn't the date that i actually get but i get a date which was actually good as well not good good like the first date that you initially have but the date that we got is really good good just the same as well so we have selected our wedding date um the venue also we select the venue is one of the top top venue right here in jamaica um they're basically providing everything that we need guys if my nose here looks a little wet is that my allergy is acting up on me so i select the venue and the reason why we decide to go with that venue is that they provide a wide variety of options so basically we just need to show off for the wedding i mean one or two stuff we actually have to take to ourselves but it's neither here nor there to be honest but they provide a full package for us at affordable price and while i was doing my research child <laughs> they want to chop us up yeah they, they're not chopping the line you know they want to chop us up okay so that venue for me is like the ideal and we i spoke to the planner we made deposit as well so i know exactly i told her exactly what we want for the wedding so i'm pretty much excited for that one yes um so far so we got the day to pay for the venue also we find a photographer that we actually going to use so it's like it's photo slash videographer so you get in one full package so i'm happy for that one we also make a deposit for that one as well so things going on girl <laughs> like when we made the first deposit it's like i'm like yes we're gonna get married i mean not saying that i didn't feel like we're going to get married but the fact that we made the first it actually felt like yes it is coming it is coming okay if we get we're getting married we're getting there um also for the makeup artist i can't wait for her to see my face i'm gonna maybe later down you guys will see who is our makeup artist but we also pay for a makeup artist who made a deposit to secure as well i know she's going to do an exceptional job because i've been following up for her for a long 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 time so i definitely know that she's gonna slay us face and slay it well so deposit is made for that one as well regarding my bridal party list i actually already knew who was going to be on the bridal party especially for the female side i already select them from the i think the day that we we got i got engaged or we got engaged if you put it that way i already select those um so both the groom and the bridal party we actually select those and i do hope to enjoy the journey with you guys and i hope you guys just work with me just the same i might be a little extra but i hope you all just put in your two cents to make this dream a reality okay so we've select the bridal party or flowers girl or ring boy we also select them as well so that is good as well regarding the guest list um that was a little tricky to be honest because you know it's a wedding day you want everybody that not just everybody but you want person that you go along with or you grow up with and to be there but reality when doing all the assessments and getting costs for stuff and all this stuff i realized that not everybody's gonna make it um do i feel bad yes i do do i not feel bad no i don't so it's like a mixed feeling because when i did all the research and i realized how much it's gonna cost to have like a bunch of people and in reality a bunch of these people we don't communicate as often not saying that those who don't get to come we don't communicate but the reality is that not everybody's going to be able to come and as what my fiance said we're not keeping a funeral where people just show up and you know show up for the support and then god them yard and it don't no this is a wedding it do cost a lot of money and yes a lot of persons say oh you don't have to have a big wedding you can have a small wedding like hell to no 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 we're going to do good and done because we're not repeating there's no after one year anniversary going back we're getting it done and we do it good now we're trusting god that you know everything can run out as how we plan i know how while we plan god why but it is what it is okay um so far so those are what we have coming in we already have our color scheme it's going to be like an all white wedding eh, eh, eh it's gonna be an all white wedding and don't come here and telling me that oh it's an insult to the bride and it's an insult to the no from day one i met alex leon sorry you don't know him as alex but my fiance um it was always an all white wedding from day one we wanted a beach wedding but y'all 
we're gonna think on the day of the wedding we're gonna behave as if we're actually on the beach the beach wedding is a whole different level of spending but i'm not gonna get into this video i'm not gonna discuss this one maybe later though i have a sit chat with you guys to give you all the updates about that that beach wedding thing so so so, so far we have those we have the color scheme that we're working with and i said it's gonna be an all white wedding so everybody's gonna be in white like every single body is gonna be white and if you are watching this and you get the invitation you feel like you're gonna come in a color that is not white y'all you're gonna be i'm gonna usher your ass out okay we're gonna usher you out <laughs> but it's gonna be an all white wedding for that um regarding the design for the bridal party i do have that one as well the ladies went to get their dress fitting so later down in this video you will actually see um that series and also for the men i think two person haven't getting their their fitting done as yet and one of my bridal party team members she haven't get a chance to do her fitting so like two person outstanding to be done get a chance to record the men but for the ladies i did actually record that process for you guys so i can't wait for y'all to see <laughs> you're gonna get it married um that's it we have so far we have an idea who's gonna be our mc or pastor or dj as well so as time progresses i do promise to come here hopefully I, I remember to take up my phone to record to give you guys all the behind so far so you guys just subscribe to the youtube channel turn on the post notification bell so the moment i upload y'all be the first to see so you're not behind on any of my vlogs you're not behind on our wedding diaries as well or a wedding journey whatever you want to call it but i'm here for y'all to give you tips and advice how to go about planning your wedding not to show off but to give you tips and tricks on preparing for your wedding but as i said there's a lot more to come and i do promise to take you guys along the journey so remember to subscribe turn on the post notification bell if you haven't get a chance to subscribe do so now at the end of the video like up the video comment down below and let me know your thoughts at the end of each video okay bye bye